Yo ko so, this is the anime Kill Counter we tally up the kills mainly in anime. The anime we're covering for this day is Kite, released in the winter of 1998. Kite is a Japanese original video animation, written and directed by Yasuomi Ometsu. This anime revolves around a schoolgirl named Sawa. Sawa was orphaned in her early teens after her parents were murdered by an unknown assailant. Sawa becomes an assassin while searching for her parents' murderer. This anime, or maybe off-brand anime, is erotic and bloody as hell. Now let's see how many croak in this anime and count them up.通重層による出血死ですね。ご六発ぶち込まれてます。朝っぱらからそうなもの見せやる。赤井さんが来るまでに初見は大体済ませておきました。ご苦労さん。そう。どういうことだ、サワ。なぜだ。こ
この時をどれだけ待っていたと思うパパとママの私からのそうは、uh, uh, 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 The kills in this anime consist of 19 males and 3 females. With a runtime of 51 minutes, Kite left us a kill on average every 2.3 minutes. I'll give the King Katana, obviously, to Akai. This dude is the worst, and I'm actually happy for Sawa on exacting her revenge unto him. The Shabi Kunai goes to Kanye. He's supposed to be one of the antagonists, not to mention his Akai's right arm, but he's killed in the most boring way by showing him already dead. That concludes the anime kill count for today. Man, I don't know what to say to this anime. This anime is actually good. The animation, the music, and the storyline is good. Though I'm not sure if this anime is an off brand anime. Anyway, Oberi's death is debatable. But just like in 91 days, I think Oberi died because the little shit shot him through the heart. That is all. Sayonara.